What's up, gang? Sorry about that interruption. Uh, uh, we realized that our video was just like crashed out for whatever reason. But we got stuff going. We got it situated. Things are going good. Um, so yeah, I'm here with Vamp. Vampiric Warrior at twitch.tv slash Vampiric Warrior. You should add him up. And uh, we're playing. We're going to be playing some two-headed giant. We, we, we played a few times. Our luck was not in our favor. But I have a good feeling about this one. I think we're going to get it. Uh, we got this. We got it. Dude. We totally got it. So we're gonna go over here to battle mode. Two headed giant. I'm gonna use the, the magic gods are not in our yeah, favor. Yeah, I'm us telling tonight. you, it's a bad luck charm. Like I've been, it is. I've been sweeping the floor in Pokemon like crazy on the Pokemon <laughs> card game. Then I play Magic and I get obliterated. Like what was it? It was last week we did a Magic uh, stream and like you guys were just laughing at how bad my pulls were. And how great the AI's pulls were, and I was like, it's just not meant to be. <laughs> it is not meant to be. Uh, you know what, though? Perseverance, man. It's Perseverance. True. Absolutely. Hey, even as skilled as I am, I still get wrecked a lot, so don't feel too bad. Yeah. It's just a learning thing, but it's at, it's at that weird point with a uh, with the learning deal that it's like, I don't know how in the world it could go any different, you know? Like, I don't know how in the world... Like, I have the same cards, so how could I have made different decisions? Um... But, you know... Well... The more you play, um, it's like I said, I think last week... You streamed Magic? Yeah, yeah. The more you play, the better you get, and... Deck building, same thing. The more you tweak, and it's all trial and error. <coughs> this isn't a bad hand. Yeah, I was about to say, actually. I feel pretty good about mine. Yeah, I'm, I'm keeping mine. Keep it. Because we got Act of Treason uh, out, uh, and then we got yep. a lot of... I have two forests, and then one flame. So, I mean, I have enough to draw, do every card. Um, oh, definitely, man. So... You can even, uh, for your Anok, you can even search your library for another land if you want. That's true. Um, Just I'm gonna to guarantee. My... I'm probably going to... Ooh, what do I play first? The mountain? Let me play my mountain first. Um... Yeah, that sounds fine. So, uh, while you were trying to do your thing, this is the deck that I built. Yeah. I just started with Mythics, pick the ones I want rares, yeah. pick the ones I want, and so forth, so, gotcha. hopefully, we got a Juggernaut, you good, artifact creature, Juggernaut attacks each turn if able, Juggernaut can't be blocked by walls, a 5-3, holy crap, glad I got that, yeah, moment. that thing's a beast, if you gave a trample, so we got this, and then, we'll put a not guide on the, on the board, um, okay, and then we will, Gonna you know, pump them or search for a land. What do you think I should do? Uh, in honesty, since you're, you need the ramp. I would search for another mountain so you can have two mountain. of each. Gotcha. Okay, so we got the mountain. Um, yeah, we'll do the mountain. Yep. And I have declaration and stone in hand, so if they play a creature that uh, we don't like, or harmful to us, yeah. I can, we'll exile it, and they get a clue which pay to sack draw a card. Hmm. Uh, but the cool, so hopefully we'll be fine. Ooh, five drop. Exactly what I wanted to see. So Inferno Fist? Uh, oh, hell yeah. drop my evolving wilds right here, though. Let me play my mana first. Um, I will play another mountain. And then I will right. play. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna play Inferno Fist and then buff up the one one. Um, if we get stuff slightly stronger near the beginning of the game, I think I have a better feeling about late game. You know. Yeah. So I'm gonna attack because I have vigilance, so I don't tap. Okay. But yeah. Gotcha. So, so he's that. he's a blocker for now. Okay. Cool. So I will confirm the attack. Yep. 
We'll hit him for five. And then next turn, I'll be able to do some fun, hopefully. It's really not a bad start for me. I got Nissa, who can search up a forest, tireless tracker that produces a clue whenever a land enters the battlefield under my control. Mm -hmm. Then I can sack the clue to give tracker plus one plus one counters, and it's great. Yeah. Yeah, I feel good about this too because it's these are cards that I know of. You know, like I know what White everything in my deck does right now. Let's go ahead for a force. Oh, that's a full that's art forest. Yeah, buddy. That's a sexy I paid forest. the gold to do it. Oh my god, let's get a zoom in on this. It's gorgeous, man. That is beautiful. I will say, you like, can, uh, the Wizards of the Coast artists are unfreaking believable. They are fantastic. We're going to play another forest. Then we are going right. to do... Let's see. Um... I... Um, I'm going to Reflector Mage the Exemplar, which means okay. next turn he won't be able to play it. Okay. Um, should I Life Spring Druid, you think? Add one mana of any color to your mana pool? And then it's a 2-1? You could, or you can put your Juggernaut out. Oh shit, I could put my juggernaut. Yeah, let's do that, bad boy. Welcome to the party, Take sir. It up. <laughs> so we got this. Okay, so the attack step. Uh it's a zero three, so either one of our attacks are gonna go through. Okay, awesome. And you got a five three to block, so if uh it's E B. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. So we'll confirm it. Probably gonna block you though. That's if they right. block you, that thing dies. Nope, oh, they're gonna block me. That's fine. Take three damage anyways. Yeah. I think we just uh, hit our goal almost. Opponent's turn. Let's see what they do. So they got. They have the cultivator. To that tap. Search your library for basic land card. Put it in your battlefield tap and shuffle your library. All right. What are they playing? They are playing a hippopotamus. What? Yep. They're gonna get a hippo. That's okay. Damn hippo. All right. Oh, Gideon of the Trials. That could be interesting. Should I do Act of Treason on the Hippo? <laughs> uh, play a Rogue's Passage. Rogue's first. Passage, okay. okay uh, now, uh, you have two elves in hand, so you could actually play Hunt's Master. Oh, and then, and Life then Spring Druid. Play your, yeah. yeah, and get that beautiful token. Ooh. What I think I'm gonna do Ooh. is Declaration and Stone the token. That's a good idea. And then Rogue's Passage. Yeah, so I'm gonna deck and stone the 3-3. Three, three, and that just removes it from the field. They don't get a clue for tokens, which is great. And that automatically attacks, so we are good to swing everything. We're just having a 0-3 on their side. Gotcha. And then None of our stuff will die. Beautiful. Yeah, we doing some work now. Yeah, man. This is the game that we're saving. This is the one. <laughs> we're professionals. YouTube ain't ready for this. That's all right. <laughs> Ooh, that five. Juggernaut. How dare you? Yep. 
I know, right? Now the smart thing... Well, see, if they would have blocked the 5-3... Yeah. We could do that anyways. <laughs> see, so we got a 3-3. Three, three. Oh, good. Caracol. Oh, damn. Okay. So... Well, the nice thing is... Yeah. Pretty much, even if they try blocking with everything... Active trees and the 3-3 three, three cat. Oh, good call. Oh, And then they'll lose their plus one, plus one. Or... That's not good. Should I... No, I'll act a treason... The hippo. Because <laughs> then it gets haste. Right? Oh, my goodness. Yeah. Give me that hippo. Give it. <laughs> All your hippos are belong to us. All of them. <laughs> so we got that. Beautiful. So I have some... Oh, I need one land. Oh no! Actually, I think I'll be fine here. Yeah, I'll be good. I'll play my Nyssa. Yes. Oh. Give me that beautiful full art forest. Oh. And then I'll be able to Thalia's lieutenant. That's so nice. And then all of my humans get a plus one, plus one counter now. No! It if Wait, oh my gosh, that's bad. I should've saved the white. My bad. Dude, I think Good we're job, gonna rock man. this out, because, like, we're about to hit <laughs> for 2, 4, 6, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, uh, 19. Is that right, what I'm seeing? Or essentially, cause, well, one has summoning sickness. Five, so, eight, 11, 17. 13, 17 damage, yeah. 17, Jesus. So, and he'll barely be alive. Your 5 3 with the 2 2, and then use the 3 3 to kill one of my creatures, probably. Oh, I see. Gotcha. Oh, well. But they're still going to be in a bad way after this turn. So. Yeah, save the Huntsmaster, though. Don't attack with that. Okay. So. You can swing with your 3 1 and the 2 3 that you, uh, act of treason. Let's see. So. It's making me use my Juggernaut, I guess. Oh, attack yep. each turn if able. Okay. So yep. I'll I'll attack with Juggernaut, but then which one do I save? The Huntsmaster. Okay. But attack with everybody else. Atta okay, so attack with their Hippo. That way if they kill it, they kill oh, it. Oh, the timer went right now. Oh, fuck! Okay. <laughs> God dang it. I forgot to stop. No, that. they took it. Holy cow. That's all right. Oh! At three. Unless they got a miracle play to like wipe the board. I think we got this one. After this. Okay, that might work. <laughs> oh. Oh. Oh man, if only I had saved the deck in stone, I could have eliminated all of them cat tokens. I might get a good hand. Hopefully I get something good. The moment. Still there? Yeah. Yeah. Let's see. Mm -hmm. 
I got that. So what do we got here? Okay. Uh, I thought that I lost you for a second. Oh no, we're we're good. Let's see. So Curd Chieftain gets a one one as long as you control a forest. Gains trample until the end of turn. Life Spring Druid. Let's see. I'm gonna play him. I'm gonna play this. <laughs> that's awesome. Give him a little four four action. Alright, um Well I have five mana. So I you're gonna have to attack with you by three anyways. Okay. But I think I'm gonna gear hole. Make him a six and then if I can put uh oh no it's creatures I control. Dang it, I was gonna buff up your uh chieftain. Oh yeah. Make him a six six. Awesome. Alright. So we can just go ahead into the next phase. Okay. We'll continue. Okay. And so... then just only attack with him. Gotcha. Okay. And then we'll confirm attack. Yep. Bye, Juggernaut. You lived a good life. You lived a good life, Juggernaut. <laughs> Wait a minute, what? They all block it? Did they really just sacrifice all their cats? Oh, I guess they don't take damage. That seemed kind of like right. a dumb play, though, on oh. the token side of things. Uh, not really, because they just gained a... Yeah. And you killed one of their creatures, and the leftover damage almost took out a second cat. Right. But now we have an 8-8 Trampler on the field. Yeah, fair play. Um, you could pop your Inferno Fist on the 2-1 cat, kill it, or you can kill the, uh, Archer over there. Oh, yeah. Kills 2 damage. So, should I go for one of the cats or the... Probably the sniper. Yeah, I would eliminate or, the cat. Okay. And this does 2 damage, correct? <clears throat> yep. So, I'm gonna take out a fresh cat. Yeah, oh boy. Because the one we can take out pretty easy. Oh, well, full healed anyway, so. But yeah, get one off the board, it's easy. <laughs> oh, that buff. Fine. Oh, they do not like your chieftain. They really don't, man. You want to seal it away? That's okay. I got Gaia's Revenge. I can play, and it can't be countered, and it has haste. No, no big deal, you know. Hopefully, if I have enough, uh, you know. I may not, I don't know. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit, they healed all the way back up. I just now noticed that. What's that? You're just kind of cutting out. They they healed all the way back up. I just now noticed that. They were at, like, yeah. 7 health, and then... Um, only thing I can... Play that we will add Oh, I can't control my or bounce my gear hawk. Oh. Curse you. <laughs> Cause it's opponent that sucks but I can do this though 
<coughs> Got a plus one, plus one counter. Oh. Yep. Yeah. And my uh, advocate's a four or five now because I have six lands. Gotcha. So then. But. I'm not attacking. Okay. I yeah. just. I personally don't feel comfortable. Okay. Yet. So I'll probably skip attack too. Yep, and then next turn you can play your Gaia's Revenge. Yeah. Ooh, and they don't have any real greens, do they? They have the Exemplar of Strength. But like... Oh, well, never mind. They just played the Hydra. Because I was about to say, Gaia's Revenge can't Lovely. be the target of a non-green spell or ability from non-green sources. But I hated him. Cursed. Now, because they don't have. Marco, my boy. What up, Marco? Look at all these trading cards. It's crazy times. What's up? Marco just joined chat. Um, Marco, what's up, buddy? Yeah, we're playing with Vamp, bro. That's what we're doing. So, that's a... Uh, so Triple I, land. So I still can't... Ooh. Yeah. Can't play anything, really. Oh, what do I get here? I got three good picks that I can choose for him. Hmm. God, this is like I think a this loaded. Might be this is a loaded board. Yeah. And you just seen what I just picked. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Six five. In his battlefield, you may search the library for non-legendary green creature card. When converted, mana cost three or less. Put it in your battlefield and then shuffle. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, and. And then I'm gonna play this. That way, I can play this. Uh, uh. Good news. Feels they don't have any flyers, so I can do this now. I can use his last ability to get an emblem, and as long as I control a Gideon Planewalk Planeswalker, you can't lose the game, and your opponents can't win the game. <laughs> <laughs> that card's so stupid. Oh, amazing. <laughs> That's right. But boys. they actually changed the rules, though, with yeah. the uh, Planeswalkers. Huh. Planeswalkers uh, or Lilianas as you want on the field. I'm not attacking. We'll skip <clears throat> attack. Yeah. But, uh... Alright, so I'm gonna tell you. I'm gonna play Bellower next turn. Search up my Reclamation Sage to destroy the enchantment that they got on my 8-8. Gotcha. Yeah. Alright, so Yeah, that seems like one of the lessons of magic early on is like you don't always have to attack every time you can. Like sometimes it's just better. Be okay. to, yeah, just better to let it go. No, for me. Marco just made a video about AOL Instant Messenger. Pour one out for AIM, man. It's December. It's all going away. All the memories. It's funny. Uh, Kami de Hobo was actually invented for AOL Instant oh, Messenger. Wait. Like, that name was an AIM name. 
first and foremost. Let's see. God, they are taking their dear sweet time on their turn. They're attacking. Jesus. Cow. Um, use the 8-5 on the 6-6. Six, six. Gotcha. I'm gonna block the 3-3. Three, three. Okay. So, um, my 3-3 three, three should block one of the... Two, block the 2-2 two, two that's attacking Gideon. With the 3-3? Three, three? Yeah. Let's see, so this one. And then the other ones are attacking our lay points, which is fine, and he'll just take one damage, and I'm okay with. Actually, no. I can use Nissa to block the 1 2, and Gideon will be fine. And then, should I block the 4 4 with a 1 1? No, I'm already blocking it. Okay. <laughs> okay, so we'll just take. Two damage, I guess. So confirm block. Two or four. Two or four. If, okay. It depends on if the three three dies or not. Gotcha. Okay. So we should be good. Yeah. Okay. I mean, it's only four damage, if anything. So we'll be fine. Yeah, we're doing two v two. It's called a two-headed giant. It's a pretty neat way to learn how to play magic because vamps way more experienced than i am so it's a great way to like understand the strategy and stuff behind it okay and that was some good blockage good deal i feel okay yeah i don't know so how i healed up for 30 but whatever oh because of the four damage that they dealt to us so i'm gonna play my bellower now okay Get my sage and un. Yes. The only one in my deck. <laughs> nice, yeah. I get to play my Huntsmaster because that's the only card I have. So. <laughs> yep, and now our, my 8 8 is free to attack oh, and block. And I just got us a token. Yeah. Yeah! Elves are the best, man. So, my Gideon's going to make an attack this turn. Okay. So, um... You can just chill. Okay. Like, don't attack. Gotcha. So I'll skip attack. Yeah. So, this is the only... They're gonna take it. Yeah. Oh no, is it bunched up for you? Do what? Let's see. Let's see uh, my side of the field is bunched up. Oh yeah, a little bit. Yeah, it looks like cards stacked on cards. Mine are getting there. Alright, so they brought their 6 6 back. getting some beefy cards out like uh, I feel good about your side but all mine is like <laughs> one one tokens and like three threes hey never underestimate an army of one one elves that's true they can turn very deadly instantly Oh, so they didn't attack. Sneaky hobbitses.
But it's alright though, I think our board state as a whole is good. Let's see, Oh, so I got Infectious Bloodlust. Oh man. Um, I should probably use it on the Hunt's Master, right? Uh, you don't want to lose a Hunt's Master, especially if you have more elves. Oh, that's true. Because that's two tokens right there. Yeah. You can play it on your guide, though. Oh, yeah, true. Oh, sweet. I get a declaration in stone. So I will use it on my guide. Yep. And now he's basically your juggernaut. Oh, yeah, that makes sense. It'll be alright, though. So I'll just attack with your guide, with just Gideon, and then I think we'll be fine. Okay. Yeah, I got a lot of Planeswalkers in this deck, so they should be able to help turn the tide for us. Yes, I see Jace there. Oh yeah, he's making an appearance next turn. Yeah, this board looks crazy to me right now. <laughs> <laughs> I know. It's his madness. Yo. Yeah, I've played out uh, with other people and both our boards look the same and it's just all gi one gigantic pile. <laughs> and our all of our we have like twenty plus lands and it'll all be connected. Oh jeez. It's just so weird. Oh, the cool thing. Read your Rogue's Passage. Pay for it to tap it. Target creature can't be blocked this turn. So, oh. future. That could help us yeah, out. Yeah, that could help us out. Okay, we're gonna continue. Okay, so... Firm. For me. That's all I'm gonna do. Okay, and then... Yeah, and then I'll confirm attack. Yep. The worst! So they block with the 6-6 six, six, or the 4-4 four, four on you. Or oh, they just take it they just all. take it, yeah. Well, it's smart. I don't know, I got a 6-5 and an 8-8 eight, eight blocker. <laughs> yeah, that's fair. Fair play. Good old get. Yeah. Ooh. High five. And somehow. So how should we block this out? Alright. Um so the let's see. I'm going to block I can't do anything. Yeah. Um I can block that four four. Take, yeah, take one of your elves. Don't block anybody with trample. Okay. So I'm thinking about taking out the champion. Alright, if you can, I'd say do it. Because I can take uh, Huntsman and one of my uh, tokens and take it out. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, it's not letting me block now for whatever reason. Gotcha, okay. So we'll try that. 
Um, yeah, and we'll confirm it. So at least we won't take a hit, I don't think. I mean, we'll take one damage, it looks like. Maybe. I'm okay with that. But I lose both my Planeswalkers, which is bad. That's true. Thanks, Magic Duels. Yeah. I did the one, and then I used a token to finish it off. Um, yeah. But not bad. I mean, kind of bad, because, yeah, the Planeswalkers are gone. Um... Wait, how do we choose uh how, vigilant? Yeah, how do we take oh bo oh boy, I gotta land. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy, I'm playing that land. Alright, um I'm gonna play Jace. Oh and I'll play my tireless tracker. My foundry could be pretty mean. For five mana yeah. and tap, sacrifice foundry of the consoles, put two one one colorless stopper artifact creature tokens with flying onto the battlefield. Yeah, that could uh definitely be beneficial. So I'm gonna go ahead and declaration stone the honored hydra okay. so they don't have a trampler. I'm gonna do the sacrifice, um, use the mana tapping key to see different ways, uh Yeah, that just allows if you wanna try and a certain mana color after. Okay, so I'll just hit okay. other spells. Um, yeah. There we got it. Okay. Alright, so can't do anything else. Oh, Zig! Zigbar in the house. What? Saying that's, what up, Zig? Saying that's just plain rude. <laughs> <laughs> So we got, we got got to attack with that, and then uh, not attack with. I'm not else. attacking. Yes, yeah. I want to. Yeah, hold my back. Anak guide has to attack, I guess. Um, so we'll yeah. confirm attack. Hopefully they take the hit. Hopefully they're real good bros and they take that hit. Oh no! Oh. Bye, Anak Guide. You served us well. It's for Guide. You served well. Yep. Okay. Infectious Bloodlust. Oh. Wait. You may search your library for a card named Infectious Bloodlust. Reveal it and put it in your hand in the shuffle library. Okay. You can make another beast creature. Okay. <laughs> I <laughs> get action, dude. And I pulled it again. Amazing. Yeah. I could do it for my uh, Hunt nice. Master. All right, I'll actually put it on my Elf Warrior token creature. Yeah. That makes more sense. I probably do the top there because they don't have flyers. Oh, that's true. Good call. That's funny. We could win the game with a bunch of one-one flyers. That'd be hilarious. Let's see what we got. Sweet time. Hmm. And, uh, finish them up. Yeah. So, we will do... Oh, hey! This oh, we can... I think Kami might be feeling a little, uh... Yeah. So I might. 
I might actually go ahead and use the Infectious Bloodlust on one of the flyers. Yeah. I think that'd be a better... So we'll All do right, that. Alright, I'll just just transform. Oh, I can still play that elemental, so I'm gonna do it. Nice. So, what creature? Should I take out that 4-4? Four, four? Or should I do that 5-4? Um... I say the five four. Okay. Kind of prevents him from uh, blocking an additional creature, you know. Yeah, gotcha. Cool. So we'll play that. We'll get rid of the old crocodile of the crossing. Okay. Gotcha. Then we'll continue. Ability. Well, I'm going to capture okay, okay. crocodile. Blow something up. So until the until our next turn, that six six is going to be a four six. Yeah. And I think here I can actually pop blue. Draw a card. See if we can. Okay, Ooh. some petal growth. That's not bad. Okay. So. Oh, Zig saying Vamp and West, one of the best duos ever. I agree. <laughs> you know it, I man. Totally agree. So, okay, we're just going to confirm attack. Uh, and then I'm going to yeah. just skip all the rest. So we'll confirm it. I mean, I could have attacked so, with my flyer. But... Oh, go ahead. Yeah, uh, Bryce could have swung with the other Thopter the as well. One one, I didn't think about that, but yeah, I could do it next round. We'll just take little chunks here and there. Yugi and Kiba. Read his uh, last ability. Pretty sweet. Look at that Jace card, though. Jace card, crazy. Oh, hey, a Timber Gorge. Yeah! Oh, yeah. And then... Target creature can't be blocked this turn. Should I use that Rogue's Passage yet, do you think? Um... Actually, you can use it on, uh... If you want, you can use it on my 6-5. Ooh, good call. So yeah, let me use that on your 6-5. And I have a Torrential Gear Hulk in my hand right now. Yeah, buddy. Okay. So we can do that. All right. Yep. We're going to hit for I'm 10 plus... damage, dude. Hell yeah. Yeah, I'm going to plus uh, Jace up again. Okay. Then I'm going to sack my clue. Draw something, see what else I can get. Make my tireless tracker a 5-4 now. Oh my god, yes! Oh! Um, I'm swinging everything. Do just it, so you're, Just so you know. Oh my god. <laughs> I got Archangel Avacyn now. Holy shit. Okay, so... <laughs> that one. Our flyer. That one. Oh, baby. Gooby, please. <laughs> about to do this. Confirm attack. Let's see how this rolls, baby. They got to make some choices now. Oh, did they play an instant? 
They did, but I'm gonna pop uh, Avacyn, give all my creatures indestructible. Okay, I thought that was a counter spell. I almost had a heart attack. All right. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay. Vamp's okay. Let's make this happen. Things are gonna happen. Hmm. Let's see. Alright. Of course, that also just risked uh, my Jace being threatened. That's okay, baby. Oh! Oh, there are three! Oh my god! Oh, and I'm one land shy from being able to flash in my torrential gear, Hulk. Oh. So now they're going to come swinging. They're going to come in swinging. And the bad thing is they're at three health. Right now. Oh no I don't. Never mind. They are at three health and they could still win the game. Depending on how this goes. don't you transform and then she deals uh, three damage to each of it's your board all right so So they're doing this block. Okay, so how are we gonna block this? All right. Um, if we can last until the next turn, we win because I have two I'm flyers to... to hit them. Right. I'm gonna block the four four okay. with my lumbering falls because it's a five five. Gotcha. Um, I'm going to block the two three with Archangel. Okay. And then you can take your tokens and block the two twos or the one ones or however you want to do it. Here, I'll take out the one one, and then I'll actually use my three three to take out their two two. All right, so that's still three damage to Jason. I'm a or two four five damage. Okay, but I'm okay with that. Okay, so I'll use my three three to go after their two two zombie. Yeah, that's fine. Okay. So we got it? I'm okay with that. Yeah. Okay, confirm block. We just gotta last to the next round, and then it's our, it's oh, our game. Oh, sorry, that's six. Yeah, I'm fine. Okay. They'll gain a couple of lives, but that's fine. It won't last long. Because that'll stop them, uh, they'll get, or that will give them less blockers next turn. Yeah, exactly. And then I can just. Yeah, bam. we we got a better board now than they do. And I can just face them for four. At least. So good. Here we go. Oh, Gooby, a goblin arsonist. The MVP. The real McCoy. Yes. He's a beast, man. He is a monster. I'm liking this arsonist. Ugh. I'll play you, So bro. now I'm going to have a 7-7 seven, seven Lumbering Falls. Yes, sir. I'm going to play that I got card. two uh, still in it's out. Target creature can't be blocked this turn. I'm gonna play it you on totally eight eight. Do, that. do we want it on your eight <laughs> eight just to be a dick? <laughs> yes. Bam! It's done. Okay. Congratulations. 
Gear Hulk, you're unblockable, my friend. <laughs> and my other Gear Hulk's coming into play now? Yes, sir. Oh, it's a slaughter. This is about to be a massacre. Wait. My Gear Hulk came in. Magic, what are you doing? What you doing, Magic? Oh, I guess, uh... You can do your lumbering falls. You can tap it if you want. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, no! I can't attack with it. <laughs> oh. You know what? It's okay. Cause... That's okay. We'll do this, and then we will also do... The other flyer. And I'm actually not going to use my Huntsman. Because I don't want them to block it. Because they would probably block yeah. it with the four. Well, well, no. They would block it with the four and then be done. And then that would just take out the Huntsman. So yeah, I'm just going to confirm. They're taking 16 damage, by the way. Alright, so that might be game. Maybe. That is game. GG. GG, Tommy. brother. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. That was a... Uh... That was actually a good game. We dropped them to three, they gained a bunch of life. Whew. We dropped them to three, they gained a little bit of life, and now they lost. This game was about 45 minutes long, by the way. Holy cow, yes. Yeah, we did it, man. We did. Wins! 30 coins. Beautiful. Racking up that money. Get cash money. It's actually a good uh, way to get 30 uh, go oh, gold besides skill quests and stuff and story if you if you haven't completed it dude that's what we should do man we should do some uh friday night magic make it a thing oh yeah i haven't actually i haven't streamed magic on a friday night in a few months nice dual yeah. stream friday night magic oh that'd be great yeah to have both streams going that'd be that'd be the legit <laughs> that she's running <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we'll uh, persuade her to learn magic because I've go. tried and failed. Yeah. Um, like I think I think Brit's gonna like Pokemon more than magic, as far as like. Yeah, Pokemon. it's it'll be easier. Um, definitely. And like Pokemon is fun, and it makes a lot of sense because you have your one active Pokemon, and then you have your bench. And but the thing yeah. I like about it is you could like evolve the the Pokemon on your bench. Without them having being active, mm -hmm. and you can like attach energy to them while they're in reserve. That way, if they kill your active oh, yeah. Pokemon and get their prize card or whatever, then you're bringing out like a stage two freaking, you know, you know, Charmander that already has like three energy attached and all this, like ready to rock and roll. Um, yeah, man. It's that's what I like about it. It feels like there's a lot of momentum behind it. Um, so probably sometime this weekend I might stream some Pokemon. We'll we'll play some online games. Um, but yeah, dude, their their online game thing is great. Like I recommend it because they give you five starter decks that you can like customize. I might and have stuff. an account. It's it's real good, man. We can play some Pokemans. I'd uh I'll have to check, but I'm pretty sure I have an account already. It's pretty good times. In fact, I. <laughs> Let me go back to the main menu. We'll exit out of this game. Fun Friday Night Magic time. And then, yeah. what I'll do... Let me open up we the old... I get you playing some Yu-Gi-Oh, though. That's true, man. I need to buy that game, because I have never played a lick of Yu-Gi-Oh. Not a single moment of Yu-Gi-Oh. And I saw... I was watching your streams. I've actually been watching your streams, like, five or six times uh, lately as you've been playing <laughs> the Yu-Gi-Oh deal. So... It's a good game. Let me do this... Let me change the properties. Shocked I still have, like, Boom. game knowledge after so long. <laughs> Let me log in. You know, Pokemon. There we go, it's live on the screen. Oh, are you going to play right some now. Pokemon now? Well, I I'm going to show people a little bit of Pokemon. Uh, I, I don't think I'm going to play a match, because, hell, these matches still take 20 minutes, 20, 30 minutes. Um, yeah. But that way you can see kind of the decks. Um, I think the most genius thing in the world is that you get codes in every deck that you buy and it unlocks stuff for free on the Pokemon online game. I think that is the most genius. Like, can you imagine if buying a Magic the Gathering like theme deck or an intro deck or a starter deck or even a booster pack got you a booster pack on freaking Magic Arena 
or magic duels. That would be nuts. No. I would be abusing the hell out of that. Exactly. Absolutely. <laughs> like, I would. that's what it is, man. Um, win one match with a theme deck that contains fire Pokemon. Well, funny you mention it. Because we got some crazy decks. Uh oh. We got. Get uh, your deck. Yeah, man. We got. We got our Luminous Frost deck, we got Mental Might, we got Midnight Surfer, Rocksteady, um, our theme decks. By the way, this on the screen right now is huge spoilers for the next few episodes of West Unboxes, by the way. Um, nice. <laughs> so, but yeah, it's, it's really good stuff. Um, and then their shop makes sense, because you can buy like boosters for the online game, or you can get like mm -hmm. theme decks and stuff. But in my opinion, and I'm this crazy guy, I'd buy the theme deck because then you unlock it for free in the game. Essentially. Oh, nice. You know what I mean? So if you go to the store and you drop 10 bucks on a theme deck, then you come in here and enter the code, you get that entire deck in the digital version of the game. Like... That's wicked. Redonkulous, right? Um, yeah, that's awesome. And then what's nice is they have trainer challenges. So it's basically versus AI... And they have gold, which is I guess is easy or like normal mode. Platinum, which is hard, and then city championship, which is like expert. But each one of these has, yeah. you know, ten to fifteen trainers that you fight. Um, and you unlock all your decks and your boosters and hidden stuff, and it even gives you booster packs. Like right now, let me go to collection. Yeah, it's been a while since I've been on there. Packs. I yeah. think a couple of years ago is when I uh, got on it. Let's see, I have like one, two, three, four, five, six booster packs that I can open whenever we play it online for the first time. So, oh, nice. So that way we can start the stream by opening packs. Sweet. But yeah, it so is. I, it's that. So I just got my account back. Oh, hell yeah. Yeah, man, the, they've really, apparently, because I've been reading about the Pokemon trading card stuff, and, like, they've really improved that game. Um, the online So game, I've heard. And, like, and even just playing the trainer matches, like, it's a lot of fun. And it doesn't feel overwhelming. Like, you saw our board on the freaking Magic game. It was nonsense. It was, like, trying to keep track of 80, you know, wild cats running <laughs> around. And it's like, oh, God, what's happening? But with Pokemon, I mean, you have an energy card, you have some trainer token type things to give you a buff or something, then you have your right. energy, and then items to heal or, like, to discard or something, and that's it. Like, that's all you got. Um, so the but see, I'm used to that, though, Yeah, it's, I've right. played Magic for it, so long. It, exactly. Um, but yeah, with Pokemon, it seems like they took all of the other stuff out. Like, there's only one main phase, there's no uh, instance or sorceries, or anything like that. Like, you just play the stuff as you get it. So it's really fast. Yeah. You know, it's like super quick. But yeah, man, thank you so much for the games. That was that was good. Oh, no problem, uh, man. The, the yeah. first batch of them didn't turn out so well, and I'm probably not even going to put those on uh, YouTube. But that second game, this main one that we did, we're definitely putting that one on YouTube. For sure, but I'm gonna open this up. Let's go back to the old. Yeah, man. I'll. Uh, I'm out. I gotta go to the back. Thank you. It was fun. Cool. Yeah, man. Everyone should go check out Twitch.tv/VampiricWarrior to watch more of our boy play some Yu-Gi-Oh and Magic. He's a pro, consummate professional. He's the man. But yeah, take it easy, Vamp. Good weekend, guys. Yeah, yeah. So, guys, that is our time. Hope you had fun playing Magic the Gathering with us. We had some technical issues for the first half, but if you're here for that second half, we appreciate it, my friend. We appreciate you. Everything you do for the stream, hanging out, having fun. We love you. Go check out the new West Unboxes videos. Got into that Pokemon. Got into that Magic the Gathering. I got this little doozy that I'm recording tomorrow. Oh, our video games monthly box came in. Very happy, very excited to see what retro goodies we got. It feels like a heavy box, too. 
but anyways guys that's my time you guys are the best we will see you very very soon here on the twitch channel and if you're watching on youtube we appreciate you we appreciate your patronage you the real mvp anyways guys that's my time we'll see you soon keep it locked right here at comedyelbow.com and and everywhere on the internet where fine purchases can be made and by purchases i mean like and subscribe and follow that's what i'm talking about all right peace